Hey to everybody out there in YouTube land. I hope that everybody is doing well. I was just somewhere and uh, just heard a, a group of women, maybe about six or eight of them, uh, complain. Well, their mother-in-laws purchased them clothing and maybe it's clothing that they, it's not, that's not their style or whatever. So, you know, it, at first it was kind of funny, uh, but then one of them was saying something about, the you you know the mother-in-law purchases useless items and now that they've had twins and I don't know if the lady was serious or not but now that they've had twins that the, the mother-in-law always purchases uh clothing for the, ch the ch useless clothing for the children that are off season you know like or whatever and I was just thinking like wow you know at first it was you know it was kind of funny because you know you were just making a joke about it but then to be mean spirited about it is a different thing some uh some I mean first of all she's the mother of your husband your spouse his mother okay and if you have children she's the grandmother of your children okay thirdly she's your m-i-l she's your mother-in-law she's your mother so she's you know and then this this woman has embraced you okay and and thinks about you when she's shopping or whatever and or when you're you know sh thinking of your children when she's shopping you should be thanking your lucky stars and or on your knees giving glory to God or thanking God for that because some are really having it hard as far as mother-in-laws are concerned. They're not embraced by their mother-in-laws. They're berated by their mother-in-laws. They're disrespected by their mother-in-laws and the like. So you should really be grateful that you have a mother-in-law or mother uh, or in-laws period whether it's a father in law sister or brother-in-law that embraces you and cares about you and has uh you know included you in family time and et cetera et cetera et cetera but it's a very disrespectful thing to 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 be mean spirited about the things that your grant that your mother in law purchases for you so let us be careful and be mindful and be wise and be um and not be so entitled and uh or whatever the 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 term is uh right now um but yeah we should really be careful so that's all i wanted to share with us today i hope that everybody is doing well again god bless you and may the lord be with you and i just want to ask you one question because it's really uh imperative that we know in this day and this hour because no one knows the day or the time uh when jesus will return so i want to ask you do you know where you will spend eternity and are you sure because some will say oh no i'm going to heaven and and they'll say well uh, but i'm asking you are you sure and then there are some that say huh there's no heaven there's no hell i'm not gonna worry about that blah 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 well i'm here to serve you notice that there is a heaven and there is a hell and there is a god in heaven as well so be mindful of that don't take it for a joke it's not anything to be flippant about it's not nothing to take too lightly we must be careful we are living in this time and in this world right now but there is another world to come and there's another dimension we must be mindful we must be careful you must be prepared get ready don't be a foolish bride be a wise bride have your lamps filled with oil and be ready for the coming of christ jesus